official Dorfest room with latest January 2023 security update is rolled out. And in this video, I am going to show what new features, customizations and other things are available in this Dorfest room. So let's get started. As you can see, this is the latest Dorfest room which has latest Android 13 available. You can see the Dorfest version with its change log inside it. Shout out and all credit goes to its respective developer who made this possible by bringing this latest Dorfest room. You can see the Android security update is of January 5, 2023 which is the latest update for now and it has the exorcist kernel used in this room. Inside Play Protect certification, devices certified and also safety net status is passed so you won't be facing any problem while using banking application in this surface. It has aperture camera pre-installed which seems to work properly. Also for better quality picture you can install Gcam in it. I have tried latest Gcam 8.7 in it and it is working flawlessly. Also, if you want to download best Google camera for your phone, then you can check my video from description where I have shown 4 methods from where you can download the best Google camera for your device. As it has Google dialer available, you won't get auto call recording feature and will receive call recording announcement, but flip to silence option is available. It has minimal apps pre-installed in it and the speed and performance is on top notch. Inside its wallpaper and styles, you will get all the features like wallpapers colors, basic colors, dark theme, themed icons, app grid, system fonts, as well as system icon pack is also included there. Talking about its launcher, it has Dorfest launcher available which is really smooth and inside its home setting there is drawer themed icons and levels are present and below in recent section so lens button is available and this will replace existing screenshot button with google lens button on home screen. Including lens is a good feature but both screenshot and lens should be available together side by side. We can also hide applications from the app drawer section but protect apps option is missing in it. Quick setting tiles look something like this and scan QR tile along with dark space tile is present there. Talking about scan QR, we can directly access QR scanner from the lock screen. There is a separate scanner icon available and just by tapping it we can access to QR scanner. Now let's check what new customizations features are included in its setting section. Inside network and internet, private DNS is available in it with hotspot and VPN option. And inside app setting, game space is available with features like income call and notification, block full screen event, auto brightness, screenshot, stay awake and many more. Inside notification, notification log is present from where we can get all the notification history log and below blink flashlight for incoming call option is present. And inside battery settings, some battery settings are available with sleep mode feature. And if you enable sleep mode, then you can choose which feature to be turned on or off like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, data or location and also we can schedule sleep mode according to our choice and inside display setting there is live display option which have features like reading mode color calibration and picture adjustment also dark theme is present but no option for custom dark themes are present and below display cutout option is present where 13 different notch cutouts are available and you can use any one you like but i'll keep the device default Inside security, both fingerprint and face unlock feature is present and here missing app lock feature is included which also have auto lock time out option. Inside gestures and motion setting, we can select between gestures, two buttons and three button navigation. Also other features like one handed mode, swipe to screenshot, quick QS pull down, brightness control, press and hold power button to access power menu or digital assistant and double tap power button to quickly open camera is present. We can also enable taskbar and this taskbar feature is really useful feature for me. It's very handy and useful for switching apps and using two apps at once through split screen. 
Also, age long swipe action and disable power menu on lock screen option is present. You can directly access to USB configuration from this system setting. Also, it has Dorfest updater from where we can update to latest version of Dorfest. This Dorfest room has its own dorp space and from where we can do lots of customizations in it i'll highlight the new features implemented in this room it has background chip option present which will display accented chip behind clock it has status bar lyrics with logo option present and we can select between different logo styles and change its position to left or right inside notification it has reticker option present if you want to change screen clock font, then there are lots of different unique looking clock font style present. One important and useful feature called parallel space is also available in this room, which will clone the app and we can use two different accounts simultaneously by creating a separate app. Inside customizations, advanced monet engine is there with lots of features in it. In this top space, we can get unlimited photos and videos upload feature on Google Photos app. This room is smooth as butter and it is quick responsive too. The performance of this room is unbelievable. Like performance, the battery backup of this room is also very impressive. I'll suggest you to use this room as daily driver as it have great user experience with great performance and customizations in it. So what do you guys think about this room? You can comment your thoughts and experience on comment section below. And if you like to see all the customization and settings of a custom room, I have explained each and every setting with its customization. So you can check that video from description section below. So thank you so much for watching this video. And if you like this video, then don't forget to hit the like button, comment down below, share this video and subscribe to our Cracksoid YouTube channel. Also hit the notification bell. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.